I have a shower stall that started to lose water pressure over time. Living in an area with hard water, this does happen on occasion. So I wanted to share a technique to remove hard water buildup that can accumulate in hard to reach areas, like the inside of copper piping. The first thing I did was to remove the cartridge and purge the lines. The water came out at full pressure through both the hot and cold water lines which feed into the cartridge. I tried installing a new cartridge, but the water pressure at the spout remained the same. So I knew the problem was most likely a hard water buildup somewhere in the pipe that connects the handle to the spout. I had a plumber come by. He said that the only way to fix this was to remove the drywall behind the shower stall and install an entirely new faucet. He quoted me $1200 for the job. Soaking an item in vinegar works well at dissolving a hard water buildup, so I decided to try to fill up the pipe leading down to the spout with vinegar. Remove the spout. There are a few different ways that a spout can be attached to the copper pipe. This one threads on. I then wrapped some Teflon tape around the copper pipe, wrapped a piece of plastic wrap around the end of the pipe, and secured it tightly with some electrical tape. Any method to block the end of the pipe making it watertight should work. I then took a syringe filled with vinegar and injected it into the opening of the main valve that leads down to the spout. This is undiluted white vinegar that I'm putting in. From all of the research I've done, vinegar appears to be safe for pipes. I first tried this with a turkey baster, but it just made a mess. You may need something accurate that can get into these tiny areas. There is a link to these syringes in the description. This is a Delta faucet. It's the original faucet in the home, which was built in 2008. This technique should work with many different styles of faucets and plumbing applications. Although I haven't tried it, using CLR may also work on a similar situation with rust. Once the vinegar starts to come out of the main valve, we should be good. I then left this to sit overnight for around 10 hours. You may need to let it sit longer depending on how much of a buildup there is. After removing the plastic wrap and tape, I flushed out the main body with some water and then reinstalled the handle assembly. This is the water pressure before. And this is what it looks like after leaving vinegar in the line overnight. The faucet's been completely restored back to full pressure. I hope this is able to help someone with a similar hard water issue. Thank you for watching.